What's up, everybody? It's Ripper here. Got something new for you. You're looking at a receipt from a septic tank service dated August 5th, 1997. If you didn't watch the past four videos that I did with the three women who used to work at Wildlife on Easy Street, go back and watch. In the interview that I had with them, Judy talks about her septic system and that she was positive that it was put in during the weekend that Don went missing. So, I thought I would try to find some type of evidence to support that or disprove it because I did make a video about a month ago and I included a clip where Carol said that Judy had moved in long before Don ever went missing. But in the interview that I had with these three ladies, there was a permit that was pulled for a three bedroom mobile home, which matches the exact description of Judy's mobile home, which is the person that Carol was talking about. The permit was pulled on August 4th, 1997. This payment for this septic install is dated August 5th, 1997, the day after the permit was pulled. The man who did the work has since passed away, so we can't talk to him, but he does talk about a drain field, a lift station with a sump pump and alarm, um, reset existing septic tank, install. So this was 10 days before Don went missing. I'll zoom in on the date for you real quick. There you see, it's August 5th, 1997. It's an old receipt, 23 years old, almost 24. But it is there, August 5th, 1997. Now, that doesn't mean that's the exact date the stuff was installed. That could have meant that's when the hole was dug and they started the process. Also, Judy talked about the place was flooded and she had to bring in fill dirt to put in out there. Well, looky what we have here. We have another receipt, and it's got Judy Watson's name on it. I'll zoom in on the date and show you what this is for. Looky there, August 6th, 1997, and it looks like it's for 21 yards of fill dirt. So is this the dirt that was brought in to backfill the septic system? Or is this the dirt that was brought in to fill like the flooded area? Because she said she basically had to raise the ground up because it was flooded. Knowing what I know, I'm going to guess on the 5th, she, she paid or got her little service ticket started to have the septic stuff put in move her trailer the place was flooded they brought this in on the six to start building up at some point they put in the septic system but she talked about it being red flagged the hole was dug too deep and what she told me was that she thinks the septic system put it in to begin with but then after it was red tagged vernon who is carol's dad actually redone it because it was in too deep so it had to be redone and she had to have dirt brought in to fill the septic hole and that's gone with the you know the theory that joe exotic had that the hole was dug too deep and he was put in under the septic system that would go along those lines now if we had some kind of evidence or proof showing that there was some backfill that was brought in to put in that hole around the time Don went missing, that would be a big piece of evidence. We just don't have that yet. Yet. But we're getting close. We're getting close to figuring some stuff out. And if, if we think about the date, August 15th is the last day that Don was seen that we know of so far, people we've talked to. That might change. There might be some other people that say they saw him later. But right now on my channel, Ann says 
August 15th, that Friday, he left the office at 1.30. He, Dawn never called her. That was it. August 14th, Ann said that Dawn and Carol had a fight. And Dawn slept in one of the, like the box trucks, one of the trailers. So let me just show you. Let me not wait. Let me not keep you waiting any longer. Let me show you this other receipt that I now have. Oh, I hope you can see it because guess whose name is on that? Judy Watson. And it is for fill dirt. Looks like it is two yards of fill dirt. And the date, you probably can't see it, so I'll zoom in for you. Looky there, August 14th. August 14th is when fill dirt was brought up. I asked Judy, I said, is that when they brought it out? Or do you know? She said she didn't remember. Now, knowing what I know, if you were to pay for something like that, they bring it out, they dump it, you pay for it, and then you use it whenever, whenever you need to. So on Thursday, I think this dirt was brought out and dumped out by probably the septic hole because it had been dug too deep, but it had to be pulled back up. Judy says she thinks that Vernon was the one who did it the second time when it had to be reset. Like it had to be dug back up and then they had to put backfill in it. This is the receipt that she has for the backfill that was brought out on August 14th. So that goes right in line with the story of her saying that it was the weekend that Dawn went missing is when all this stuff happened. This this receipt goes right along with her story. This would put the, the backfill dirt there. The system would have had to been pulled up. They would have had to put the dirt back in the hole and then the septic system back in there. That could have been done over the weekend that Dawn went missing. I mean, this is pretty incredible that I'm going to zoom out on this just a little bit. That it's pretty incredible that I have these receipts right in front of me for, for many reasons. But one reason is Carol said it was long before Dawn went missing that this stuff happened. That is not the case. We know without a doubt by looking at these receipts that it was the weekend that Don went missing when the septic work was being done, or at least the dirt was brought out. Why would she say it was long before? Why would she lie about that? And then we also, I believe Judy said that Sheriff Cronister said that this was done years after Don went missing. Well, that's not the case either. We have it. It's right around the time Don went missing. So if law enforcement ever needed more evidence, I think they have it. I just don't think they're going to act on it. But this, this shows to me, without a shadow of a doubt, that that septic system was put in and being worked on the weekend that Don went missing. They had everything they needed to dump a body in there and cover it up. And nobody would have ever known, and nobody still knows till this day. I've offered, I've left messages, I've emailed Carol to come out and dig that thing up. She has not called me back. She's not emailed me back. Why not? Why doesn't she want that dug up? Um, I have my guesses. I think I know why she doesn't want it dug up. That maybe, maybe she'll come out and let us do it. Now, I think people should... Ask her why she is not letting me come dig that up. I will put a new one in, just like she said. She said, if anybody wants to come out and dig it up, they can do it. They just need to replace it. Well, okay, we'll do that. Let us dig it up. Let us see what's under there. Let's take this cloud out from over your head. Let's find out if he's in there or not. Let's find out. Everybody, this is Ripper. Before I go, I'm just going to say... To my wife, I miss you. It's our wedding anniversary today. I'm sorry I'm not home with you, but I will be back soon. I love you. Everybody, it's Ripper, and I'm out.